Pakistan, the land of a thousand opportunities. Along with its rapidly growing economy and bustling heritage sites, it is home to a number of languages and cultures, as well as being the host to all four seasons and possessing a variety of terrains. Blessed with natural and historical riches, Pakistan's breathtaking destinations include magnanimous mountain ranges, rolling lush plateaus, all dotted with an abundance of pine trees and crystal clear waters to the north. Desolate, yet alluring in expansive deserts towards the south. In between both extremes, it hosts countless mausoleums, mosques, gardens and lakes. The country's manufacturing sector is thriving, with cotton, textile and apparels being the largest industries. Pakistan is predicted to be the world's fastest growing Muslim economy in 2017. As a country that is just 70 years of age, we have overcome many obstacles in our way. We have done wonders internationally in all sectors. Rising from the beds of the Arabian Sea, Pakistan is one of the most strategically located countries in the world today. According to David Darst, former MD and chief investment strategist of Morgan Stanley, with over 100 million people below the age of 30 aspiring to change their lives, the rise of Pakistan is just a matter of time. Pakistan is home to Arfa Karim, who in 2004, at the age of nine, became the youngest Microsoft certified professional in the world. Like young Arfa Karim, Pakistan is brimming with IT talent, a result of world-class universities, a vibrant IT industry, and strong government support. The strong IT ecosystem has attracted world's most reputed IT companies such as Oracle, Microsoft, and Cisco to Pakistan. Realizing the importance of a strong IT industry infrastructure and its subsequent positive impact on Pakistan's economy, the Ministry of Information Technology established Pakistan Software Export Board to ensure sustainable growth of Pakistan's IT industry. Pakistan's IT exports have grown by more than 11 times over the last decade, growing at 30 to 40 percent every year. Pakistan IT competence pool is probably the, the untapped secrecy of the world. I mean, that's a jewel available there, and this is opportunity. And I hope that will become more widely known in the world in the coming years. It's very difficult not to consider Pakistan in IT. Pakistan has great potential. Only a small percentage of it is fulfilled. And it has all the ingredients for a successful IT industry. Presently, there are 14 IT parks in main metros. And plans are underway to set up more IT parks within both primary and secondary cities of Pakistan to meet the growing demands of the industry. 
Located in the heart of major cities, these STPs would feature redundant services to ensure that IT companies can meet the mission-critical needs of their customers on a 24-7 basis. Pakistani IT companies have expertise in different IT services, including high-end, enterprise-grade software development, systems integration, mobile apps, gaming, animation, consulting, and BPO services. Pakistan has produced some great gaming studios. The title animation sequence of Game of Thrones, the world's most watched TV series these days, has been produced by Hamid Shokat. Pakistani visual effects artist Mir Zafar Ali has received three Oscar awards for his work in The Golden Compass, Life of Pi, and Frozen. Novera Masood, a Pakistani animator, has provided stunning visual effects in some of the most popular Hollywood movies, including Maleficent, A Christmas Carol, Thor, Transformers 3, and Jack the Giant Slayer. Like Novera Masood, Lareb Atta is another emerging visual artist from Pakistan who has worked on visual effects for popular Hollywood flicks such as X-Men, Godzilla, and Gravity, to name a few. Koeen Thizen, co-CEO of Asia Internet Holdings, said, It seems that the country naturally has the entrepreneurial gene. A major chunk of the company's investments in Asia will be in Pakistan. With more than 14 software technology parks, four submarine cables with satellite backup, five 3G, 4G operators, English-speaking IT professionals and high-quality resources available at up to 70% savings on annual operating costs when compared with North America and Europe. Pakistan is fast becoming a preferred destination for IT outsourcing and investment. According to Jim O'Neill, a British economist, Pakistan would become the 18th largest economy in the world by 2050 with a GDP of 3.33 trillion US dollars, almost the same size as the current German economy. So the future looks very bright and promising for Pakistan, especially its IT industry and its budding young talent. Today's Pakistan is well placed as a significant player in the global IT industry. It is just the beginning of an age of budding, talented entrepreneurs and professionals riding the tides of impossibilities to make them possible and setting new standards in the global IT industry like the young Arfa Kareem.